वेलकम वेलकम टू जेट प्लस इज अ एबेलियन ग्रुप यू आर नोइंग विद दैट व्हाट इज एन एबेलियन ग्रुप वी हैव डिस्कस्ड इन अनदर क्लास सी हियर सपोज जेड इज द सेट ऑफ इंटीजर वी आर एजीनिंग जेड इज द सेट ऑफ इंटीजर and let us assume a b c all these elements belongs to z first of all one by one we have to prove that it is a abelian group see the points what to prove first is we will prove a since it is plus this binary operation a plus b hmm. Since a is an integer, b is an integer. Sum of a plus b, that is a plus b, is always an integer. Five plus eighteen is an integer. Thirteen minus seven is an integer. Zero plus five is an integer. So anyway, sum of any two integers is an integer. So a plus b belongs to J. So this is the this is true for any two integers. Belongs to J. Hence, this is the first point to be proved. Next, we will find that what is the identity element. Even knowing a plus zero equals to a, that is zero is called the right identity element. Similarly, zero plus a. Is also equals to a. Hence, zero is called the left identity element. In other words, we can say identity element is zero. So we got an identity element. Next, we have to prove the third point. See what are the points we have to prove. That a plus b plus c is equals to a plus b plus c. That is called the associative property. Even knowing that if a b c are integers, for all integers, a plus b plus c and a plus b plus c. This property, this integer that are associated, and if we are saying an example, five plus two plus seven, this is equals to five plus nine equals to fourteen. If we are writing five plus two plus seven, that is equals to seven plus seven equals to fourteen. Again, this is true for any integer. So this, that's why this is called it is associative. So this proves that it is associative. So we prove three things. Now come to the fourth. We have to search an inverse element. You are knowing a plus Minus a equals to zero. True for any value of a, seven plus minus seven is zero. Twenty plus minus twenty equals to zero. Or it is also equals to minus a plus a. This is true for any a. Hence, for each element a, there is an inverse element minus a. For each element minus a, there will be a inverse element a. So inverse element exists for all the elements in set of integers. So in this way, this one. Now the last one you have to remember. Now itself we can say it is a group. To prove it abelian group, we have to say show that it is commutative. That is a plus b for any two element 
in z of int a and a and b is also equal to b plus a. a plus b is also equal to b plus a. You are knowing 20 <coughs> plus 1 equals to 21 and 1 plus 20 is also 21. Hence it is commutative. So in this way, first we have seen, you have to show all these five properties eh, to prove that z plus 1, z plus is an abelian group. First we have proved a plus b for any two element a, b belongs to j is a plus b also belongs to j. That is it is closed. Second is we have to prove that identity element. We find there is an identity element. Then we have shown it is associative. Then we show that for each element A, there is an inverse element minus A. And finally we have shown A plus B equals to B plus A, that it is commutative. If all these property holds, that's why we can say Z plus is an abelian group. Thank you.